After the shock of hearing that Yan Ho is going to get married, Eun Ho continues to lose focus on her work and makes mistakes because of it. As a result, So Chin Guk takes the opportunity to cut her out of all the shows she is in. Because of So Chin Guk's harsh words, which question what's so good about Eun Ho that Yan Ho wants to protect her, Eun Ho starts to blame herself for everything. When she compares her diary with Haye Ri's side by side, she realizes how her world seems so negative and unhappy compared to Haye Ri, who is always happy about even the smallest things. Eun Ho then writes to Haye Ri, expressing how she wishes she could be happy. This also implies that she is letting Haye Ri take over, as Haye Ri had previously mentioned, wanting to use the body because it feels much happier when it's her. That's why Haye Ri writes back, stating that she is taking over the body, which prevents Eun Ho from going to work. However, since Eun Ho can't be contacted, Shin Jung asks Yeon Ho about Eun Ho's whereabouts. Knowing that Eun Ho has taken all her leave, Yeon Ho thinks she must be on a trip somewhere, but she is still worried about her. If He Ri were to appear, she would come to work in parking management. However, Ju Yan is unable to see her, as he decided to wait for her to appear after learning from Eun Ho that He Ri is her alternate personality. He keeps asking Min Young about Hai Ri until when she hears someone knocking, she immediately tells him, Kang Ju Yan, Hai Ri didn't come in today either. Ju Yan leaves and continues working in his office until it's time to leave. He returns home feeling empty and decides to search for Eun Ho on the internet. He soothes his longing for He Ri by watching Eun Ho's videos. At Eun Ho's house, she leaves her phone behind while Yan Ho and Ju Yan keep trying to reach her. Later, he goes to find her at her house, but sees the pile of newspapers, indicating she has been away from home for quite some time. Remembering that he saw Yan Ho with Eun Ho before, he decides to find Yan Ho at the PPS office. Yan Ho approaches him, mentioning that Ju Yan has been looking for him. Ju Yan greets him, and they introduce themselves, with Yan Ho noting that they have met before. Yan Ho then asks what he came to see him for. Ju Yan tells him that he wanted to ask about announcer Ju Eun Ho. This makes Yan Ho question who he is to ask about Eun Ho. Hearing this, Ju Yan mentions that he also wanted to ask Yan Ho about his relationship with Eun Ho, to which Yan Ho replies that they are colleagues. Yan Ho questions Ju Yan, looking skeptical. Ju Yan explains that he has seen them together, showing affection for each other. Because of this, Yan Ho continues by asking what Ju Yan's relationship with Eun Ho is. Ju Yan replies, I'm the one who's been dating Ju Hai Ri, Ms. Ju Eun Ho's other personality. Since He Ri is not coming out, Ju Yan really wants to meet Eun Ho. However, Yan Ho is confused and surprised by Ju Yan's statement, as he didn't know anything about it. Yan Ho tries to find Eun Ho at her house. Since he previously saw her enter the password, he is able to get in. Inside, he finds a diary on the table and realizes that Eun Ho might really have multiple personalities. He then goes to see the doctor Eun Ho has been seeing, as Yan Ho needs to know when she started to have dissociative identity disorder. He questions whether Eun Ho is suffering because he broke up with her four years ago. And if that's the reason, she is unwell. He blames himself for what is happening to her. Looks like Eun Ho is going to the place where she spent the day with He Ri at their grandmother's house. Later, after Eun Ho finds meaning in happiness and learns not to hate herself, she will return. Realizing how much they still love each other, when they see each other again, both will run to each other, truly happy when together. They will make up on the same stairs where they broke up. Uon Ho also shares her struggles with Yan Ho, telling her how she has never been happy. No matter how hard she tries, she feels she can never experience happiness, even for a single moment. As Yan Ho understands why Mija wanted him to get married, and realizes he doesn't need to worry about the grandmas, he can finally pursue his feelings for Un Ho. It is evident that Un Ho and Yan Ho still like each other because they didn't date anyone during their four years apart. Tune in for the next episode as Un Ho tries to find her happiness, and Yan Ho learns about her struggles. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.